I wanted to bring you a video today on the binoculars I wear on my chest when I am hunting. And the reason why I want to bring you guys this video is because I know that there's so many options out there when it comes to glass. And this is just my take on, on trying out a lot of different glass before going with this brand and this particular size glass. So I want to give you guys a quick breakdown. Um, you know, again, this is just my opinion on what my thoughts are when you go out and choose glass and what I particularly like to, to use myself and what I found trying a lot of different brands. So what you guys see in my hands right now is the Zeiss Victory HT. This is a 10 by 54. So it's a 10 by 54. So most guys run a 10 by 42 on their chest. And what that means is you have 10 magnification, you have 42 you have a 42 prism in your in your glass, so you're allowing that much light in. The bigger that second number, the more light is allowed into the glass. And as you guys can see, this is a pretty decent size pair of glasses. You know, I mean, it's it's pretty good size. It's like a 12 by 52. Now, the reason why I went with a 10 by 54 is really simple. I like I like the ability that a 10 power gives me when I'm talking about just seeing things close by. And I have these on my chest, so now, obviously, I can get out and see some distance with these glasses, but a majority of the glassing that I'm doing is just, you know, a few hundred yards away. I'm not glassing a quarter mile away <laughs> um, with this particular pair of glass, and I like that. When you're in an environment like an archery hunter like me, or, you know, you, you've got a client and you, you're getting in close on an animal, this allows me to really pick up a, enough light in the early mornings and late evenings or in those weird shady environments where I can see things that are really close to me and I'm not you know, focused on uh, like a, a visual effect in glasses because I've had that before, um, I can really pick up a clear picture. And I like that. And this particular pair of glass is a Zeiss glass. So if you know anything about glass manufacturers, you know, every big company has their own glass manufacturer, but there's no right or wrong into what glass fits you the best. And there's no one that's better than another other than the quality of the glass that's inside of the actual binocular. And there are companies out there that, you know, have better glass than others. But the big names, they're all generally pretty good. And that's why you can take one high-end brand, put it up to your eyes and go, that's okay. And then put another up to your eyes and go, that's really good. Simply because the glass that's inside of the binocular is going to be a little bit different. And everyone's eyes are a little bit different. So you have to choose the brand that fits with your eyes the best. So, you know, I'm not here to bag on different brand binoculars, but Zeiss for me was my favorite glass. I put Leicas up to my eyes. I put uh, um, Swaros up to my eyes. The Anal Pures are beautiful. I got my dad a pair of those. Um, but they just didn't do what Zeiss did for me. So I really like Zeiss as a brand, as a company. I like this particular size binocular. Um, it's not a 12 by 54. It's a 10 by 54, which again, allows me to still pick up that um, pick up all that light and it allows me to pick through things in a little bit better way from my uh, my particular eyes So I like this size glass I had the opportunity to go with an 8 by 54 or 12 by 54 and I chose the 10 because it was in the middle Didn't give me too much magnification at close distances to where I couldn't find things which again I'm an archer hunter. I'm in the weeds. I'm looking for horns You know, I'm, I'm looking for things that are close to me at, at short distances. I'm picking through brush so that's why I chose this size. Now, the next piece of advice when you guys go out and kind of pick up pick up your, your optics is just put them in your hands, man. See how they feel. And then I always throw up and I, I try to adjust. I try to get some adjustment out of the, the top knob to figure out my focus because some binoculars are really hard to focus and some, some of them aren't. And that's something I look for in my binoculars. I've picked up other people's binoculars and I've thrown them to my eyes and of course they're a little off because they're for them but then I as I get them settled in I'll put them up and then I'll put them down and I'll put them back up and they're they got messed up again so something that I really like about what Zeiss has done is the actual adjustment knob it's it's fairly you know it's fairly easy to adjust and it's staying consistent you know to whereas a lot of companies that again that I tried not all of them they're a little bit fidgety, fidgety on the adjustments and What's cool about this particular glass is it gets crystal clear at like a foot. I can literally put my hand up in front of me at one foot and I can get it crystal clear. Um, and then I can pick things out apart way at a distance with this glass. So Zeiss 10 by 54s is what I use for all my Western big game hunting and hunting in general. I love this glass. It's a really high quality glass. Pick these up for 1600 bucks and I think they're going right now for right at two grand or 2100, which, you know, that's a good deal. So. 
Go out there, try out the big name brands, see what you like. I particularly like this particular glass. I like everything about these glasses in general. Um, and again, I'm gonna tell you that these are the best pair and you're gonna tell me that yours is the best pair and you like your glass and I like my glasses because that's how our eyes work. And you know, Americans are opinionated, but <laughs> at the end of the day, this is my choice. I really, really like them. They're packable, they're lightweight. They work really good, they feel good. They're crystal clear, probably the clearest glass in the market today. <laughs> There's that, yeah, mine are better than yours comment. Um, but on the serious level, this is what I pack. Um, not too big, not too heavy, just the right size, crystal clear, and I really like everything about what Zeiss has done with their binoculars. So with that, you guys, that's what I'm using for Mule Deer, that's what I'm using for Elk, that's what I'm using for Lions, that's what I'm using for every single type of big game out there. This is the one that I choose, so adios. Thank you.